This is Mark. Thanks for watching. Hi, this is Mark. This is how to make a tuna sashimi burger. Okay. The ingredients. You will need wasabi, buns, a food processor, baby lettuce, fresh tuna, scallions, a cucumber, fresh ginger, soy sauce, sesame seed oil, and mayonnaise. Okay, let's make it. Chop the tuna into cubes. After chopping the tuna into cubes, place them in the freezer for about 10 minutes so they get extra cold. Mince up some green onions or scallions. And place them into a bowl. Mince up some fresh ginger. and place it into the bowl with the green onion. Add one tablespoon of soy sauce into the bowl with the green onion and ginger. Add one teaspoon of sesame seed oil into the bowl with the green onion, ginger, and soy sauce. Take out the tuna from the freezer and place it into a food processor. Grind the tuna so it has the same consistency of ground beef. Place the tuna in the bowl with the green onion, ginger, soy sauce, and sesame seed oil. Mix it all together with your hands. <laughs> Form the tuna into patties. Cover the patties and place them into the refrigerator to keep cold. Now it's time to make the wasabi mayonnaise. Yay! Put some wasabi paste in a bowl with mayonnaise and mix together. This would be a good time to do the dishes. I, I hate the dishes. Slice the cucumber and get some baby lettuce ready. Place some olive oil into a frying pan. Take out the tuna patties from the refrigerator and place some buns into a toaster oven. Heat up the frying pan and place the tuna patties in it. Mm -hmm. 
Grill each side of the patty for a few minutes. Place the cucumbers, baby lettuce, and a tuna patty on one bun, and spread the wasabi mayonnaise on the other bun. Now it's ready to eat. Mmm, yummy. Okay, great. Enjoy your burger. It's healthy. Okay, great job. We'll see you next time. Take it easy. Bye.